You start thinking about it. Miguel Tamburini hits the bullseye. That's when you messed up. Every time. How much training is that take? How much passion is that take? His passion helped him beat the odds. Coming from a you know third world country uh, in a household with only one single mom, a Jew, you know, in a poor neighborhood, it's, it's been going against the statistics all of my life. Miguel moved to America, eventually becoming an axe-throwing professional. I was number one in the world for the first time in the winter season 2020 and in the winter season 2021 again. Number one in the world after just a few years' experience. This is, you know, what I do. This is my dream. This is what I live and breathe. Axe-throwing is his passion and now his whole career. Building this and building a business during the pandemic it's just going against the statistics. But again, I've been going against the statistics since I was born. Miguel opened Jumping Jack Loop in October 2020. Until the governor went back to phase one. And then we reopened the last week of February. That February opening, for good. Business started booming inside. But outside... Man, we sure miss garage land, you know? Garage land closed down. Are they closed? You know, the walking started going down and down and down. And then they started building this huge building right next to us. They take the whole street so nobody knows that we are here. We have no walk-ins. With no walk-ins, Jumping Jackalope is only relying on online bookings. Miguel's passion has gotten him through. I'm on that phone, on that computer from since 8 a.m. in the morning until 3 or 4, almost every day. Growing his business. This is the community's favorite venue award. Yeah, that's my and winning awards. Major accomplishment that I have. Maybe not hitting the bullseye on his location, but definitely as a local business owner. So Jumping Jack Loop has this location here in downtown Spokane. They also have one over in Coeur d'Alene, and they're doing so well that they're planning on opening more throughout our area. In Spokane, Nicole Hernandez, Crumb 2 News.